Hi, I'm Scott. And I'm Oscar. And together we are the Ginfluencers UK. You went, hi, I'm Oscar. There you go. Anyway. The gin we're trying today is Fine Dry Gin by the Boutique Distillery. This gin is made in the Cotswolds, one of our favourite areas in the UK. It is, it is indeed. Yeah, we love it up there. This gin contains 13 sustainably sourced botanicals and pure Malvern spring water. The botanicals include juniper, red grapefruit, chamomile, New Zealand foja, if whatever the, <laughs> however you pronounce that, coriander and cardamom, gently crafted through vapour distillation in a one-of-a-kind copper steel named Genevieve. You won't believe it, but this water is actually from the Malvern Hills and they actually collect it themselves in their, dub, in their VW camper van named Wilfred. Wilfred, yeah. what a name. Today we're making a classic gin and tonic using premium tonic water and garnishing with hibiscus flowers. Other garnishes they recommend are any citrus, cucumber or berries, but we've got them to hand, so why not? Yeah, it comes in a 50 centiliter bottle with an ABV of 45%, which is quite high, and a price of £40. As always, we'll be trying it neat first. Should we do that? Let's do that. Let's do it. Now, I've never tried this. You've never tried this either, have you? Um, no. No, I don't think we have. No, so I'm trying to get this. Oh, here we go. Oh, are we going to struggle? No, we're not. We're not oh. going to struggle. Look at that. I do like it when you struggle. Yeah, I know. There we go. Well, well, I am a little bit because it's coming off in dribs and drabs. So let, let me, let this, me. This is, this is not good TV. Well, it's, luckily it's not TV. This is YouTube. And uh, thank you for watching. Yes, you indeed. You have that. There we go. Oh, there, there we, we go. go. Right. You can clean that up if you like. Yeah, I'm, that's, I, I waited. You can, no, you can clean that bit up. So there we go. I like the colour though. It Ooh. reminds me of the Ooh. Eau de Neal of uh, wow. Fortnum's. That is shot. so peppery. That smell is amazing. There's a lot going on there in that smell. I could smell that coming off that. Yeah, there's a lot of pepper. A lot of pepper in there. That's, wow. Right, let's try it. God, I love that peppery smell. See, I love pepper. Oh, wow. That's amazing. That taste is amazing. That is unique. Yeah. So that's there's a there's a load a load of floral things in there. It's very floral, wow. but it's really spicy at the same oh. time. It isn't wow. it isn't like um, a bouquet of flowers. You have got loads of floral stuff going on. You have got loads of spicy stuff going on. It's going wah in your mouth. <laughs> it's doing what? It's going wah oh. in your mouth. It really is. That is amazing. It's zingy and all. It's one of your zinginess. Do you know what? We've had quite a few zingy gins. I don't know what you guys are putting in there, you distillers, um, but you're making zingy gins, which is nice. I wonder if you're doing it for us. Doing it especially for us. Especially for us. You're paying <laughs> lovers of gin, as we are. Um, this is lovely. This is the, like the neat. This is so drinkable. It, I mean, it is peppery. It is it's definitely, very peppery. It's, if you don't like pepper, see you don't like pepper as, as see I have pepper on everything. And no. I, I don't just have crushed pepper, I have normal No, I do pepper. like pepper. I like black pepper and I like pink oh. peppercorns. I just don't like the white pepper that, that you kind of put on. The smell is amazing. And I don't like chili, but no, oh. I like this. I'm enjoying this, so I'm, I'm picking this off because it's, uh, yeah. it's right. annoying me. Let's put this in a tonic because that is, I, I already like it like that. Right, let's do it. Cheers. Cheers, Oscar. Cheers, Scott. Oh, it just smells lovely. Mind the potpourri. <laughs> he doesn't like that oh. we had hibiscus flowers. I said, what do you want to use as a garnish? Because they recommend all these things. Well, we've got hibiscus flowers in there. I was like, yeah, but he doesn't really like potpourri in a glass. Need I like strainers. I like the fact that it starts to send it pink. I, I think that's lovely. I it looks nice. good. The presentation is brilliant. Well done to you. Mm. Right, as far as the taste goes, that is lovely. That is lovely. 
Sorry, I got distracted by him dancing. I know, I saw that. Our camera operative was uh, flossing. I don't know, what's the term that the youngsters use nowadays? Anyway. Anyway, um, getting back to the gin. Oh. Really lovely gin, lovely and floral, which I like. Spicy. See, it's, it's a, now it, it's opened up more floralness. It's still peppery for me. Mm. Spicy. Spicy is the word. It's nearer, um, like, not Indian food, but going that direction. Well, a lot of those spices anyway are in most gins, but mm. to different different levels, obviously. Oh, the smell is amazing. See, I, I don't get as much spice as you get from it. Mm. I get all the floral notes coming out. But then I'm a sour person. Mm. <laughs> he is, yeah. He's very bitter. You're very in, yeah. Yeah, yeah whereas I I'm am. really sweet. You are incredibly um, no, I'm really, sweet. Really, really sweet. Um, yeah, this is this is this is one of those gins, but is is up in the the unique shelf. It is. It yeah. is different. Out, out of all the gins we've tasted, this is a flavour unto itself, and it's lovely and smooth. Yep. Malvern water. There you go. There you go. Do again, they collect please. their cells? I think that is absolutely amazing. They go along. Who Gato's calls a camper van Wilfred? I know, but it's legendary, isn't it? Come on. Or what would you what would you call it? If we had a camper van, what would you call it? Bob. Bob. Bob the camper van. There you go. Oh no, see I'd, I'd Bob. want something I'd I'd want Jasper the camper van. No, see I I see Bob from uh, um, what's it, Black Adder, and you see Jasper from Bob. Jasper Carrot. Mm. Bob. Um anyway, Bob. getting back let's let's not go on Sorry. about camper vans or um yeah. This has gone to us. Mm. Mm. Yeah, anyway, back to the taste of this. I like that. I think, do you know what? I actually would like to try that with food. Right, I like the fact that you can still get juniper out of it, but there are so many different flavors in mm. there as well. Um, the floralness for me, it just doesn't, doesn't die. The floralness is really, really there. And you know for me, I'm a floral person. Mm. The weird thing is you're not a floral person. Nope. And so you're getting I'm those getting other I'm getting the pepperiness. Yeah. But we have distinct and tastes. And I love pepperiness. So, a lot of, on our gin journey, mm. we've discovered that we are liking a few more things together, which has been which is weird shocking. because we were always very different. Always when, very, when, yeah. we, when we were drinking less um, less uh, amounts of gin, yeah, less, not less amounts, but uh, less variation. Yeah. Now that we've we've created this huge collection, because um, there was a lot, but a lot of them was samey, mm. very samey. Um, and then uh, we decided which ones we liked, uh, he liked, ones I liked, and that's what we pretty much stuck with. But now we're finding some that are, there's a real crossover, like hybrids. Yeah, but also the fact that there's so much more flavour-wise. That gins now are not are not what they used to be, and I find it really interesting because I belong to a lot of Facebook groups um, regarding gin, and gin's such a marmite thing. Bearing in mind we say we like gin. There are people on there that are putting up pictures and saying that they like a certain gin that we've tasted and we absolutely hate. Yep. Vice versa, there are some that, that I like and he doesn't like as much, but there are other ones that we've kind of put up and we've, we've tasted that people are like, really? I can't stand it. Yeah. Like, it's, it's so weird. But that's, that's the good thing about gin. There's so many different flavors involved in it. It's not like a vodka, which is a base spirit. There's so many different flavors in there that it is going to be suitable for some person somewhere. Absolutely. People say they don't like gin. You just haven't tried the right one. Yeah, yeah exactly. There was so when we when we started this a couple of years ago, there was three and a half thousand commercially available yeah. uh, gins. I'm not saying there was, there was probably more than that, right? I think there's up to about five thousand now. Plus, yeah. right? And if you can't find a flavour that you like. <laughs> Maybe alcohol is not for you. And it, it is the thing that we do. So our, our main passion is drinking gin. Mm. So we like trying different gins. It's, it's our, our favorite Our thing. life does revolve around that. Everything yeah. we do, we bore people oh. who come around here, uh, talking about gin and uh, uh, the way forward with it. Yeah. But we but enjoy it. This one is so different. It, the weird thing is I'm getting one, one taste and so you're getting cool. another. I know, that, that's the weirdest thing yeah. for me. Because you're it's, not getting the same flavours no, I'm getting I'm, at I'm, all. No, I'm getting a tiny bit of floral, whereas I'm getting more peppery. More, more peppery. And, and I, you're getting I, more I spice, and I'm not. I'm getting, I'm getting floral. This one will be a really interesting one. So this one here um, is raspberry and, and hibiscus. 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 Um, so I, I think... I don't know if you'll like that one. 
See, I, I, I was pretty sure I would like this one. Yeah. Right? That one, I'm totally unsure of. But we don't know. But saying Because that, I didn't think you would like this one. But you generally, when you like, you know, the raspberry ones that we've had in the past, you've really liked. Mm. So we like raspberry. I like I like raspberry over strawberry and stuff and things like that. But this this one tastes really good. I really want to it's try really that good. with food. Let's score this. Yeah, let's score it. And from one of our favourite places, the Cotswolds. We mm. are there quite often, actually. Um, okay. Well, this is a tough one, actually. Hold on. Yeah. You ready? Yeah, yeah, I'm gonna go with that. Yep. Go. Yeah. Oh, you can't go the same as me. <laughs> I want this See, bottle. I, I thought you would have gone I less didn't mean than to ten hit in there. It's like, I, oh, it's like, ow! Yeah, ow! It's not, it's not domestic Don't, violence. Oh. It's like, no, please. Heal. Heal. No. Um, yeah, I didn't think you'd go as high as that. Really? Yeah, because. But, but, but mind you, it's, it's weird because we're getting two completely different flavours. Uh, uh, and I can't spectrums. work that out because I, I'm getting floral and he's getting spice. I could and quite I'm not happily getting have spice, this. I'm getting floral. Well, you, well, no, no, well you're yeah, getting, we're going to fight half, over that. Yeah, um, yeah this, this is... I I'm nearly did you. a nine, but I thought, no, it's actually... It's drinkable and uh, we may have to put a third category in where we start doing it with food to see. Let's see, just try and split these uh, tiebreakers. Anyway, um, um, the boutique distillery. I love it. We've got batch number seven, look at that. Oh, bottle number 99, oh, look at that. Look at that. Fantastic. Right, I really liked it, 10. He really liked it, 10. I'm annoyed because obviously we have to share the bottle because I didn't want to share this. We really look forward to doing this one. Um, you people out there, so obviously if you watch us, you like gin. I'd recommend this. It is yep. very different. So if you're in a household where one of you likes uh, kind of savoury stuff and the other one likes kind of um, floral stuff, then go for this because we're getting both different flavours yep. out of it. One hundred percent. This is this is so weird. Okay. But anyway, don't forget to like and subscribe. Drop Do that. Us a comment if you want. I'm gonna speak to you soon. Cheers. 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 Cheers.